Hold up. Welcome everyone for this week's vlog. We are going to Houston, Texas. It's 5.30 in the morning right now. We are driving to Houston, Texas. We are going to the American Fitness Expo. We're gonna see Jason Post Stone, Colin Von Moger, Jay Cutler, all those guys. It's gonna be exciting. Hey, James. Hey, what's up? Uh, I was thinking, you know, going down the highway, 70 miles per hour, yeah. Have you ever been in someone who just pulls the e-brake? Uh, well, I've seen it in the movies, but you know, never in real life. Well, done at 40 though. So. I did a, I did a, a Fast and Furious. Like I watched all of them, all at uh -huh. one time. And they, some of them have like tutorials in them. Oh. And so I was saying, we try it. Oh, what? Oh no, I don't think so. That yeah, dude. Uh, dude. It's I, I watched the tutorial and it tells you what to do. It tells you what to do? Yes. How does it tell you what to do? Because you, all, all you do is you just pull the e-brake. Okay. And, and you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna spin, you're gonna probably, you know, it's not gonna be bad though. It's Whoa. a two lane highway. Well, but this car is behind us though. <laughs> but the, I'm in a Mustang. All I gotta uh. do is... That, All I gotta do is speed up again really fast. So how does how does that qualify you as a professional drifting Tokyo drifter? I don't okay. I don't understand. But you can't get professional without trying. <sighs> well, this is not the place to try. What about a racetrack or something? Well, you know what? I don't have a racetrack. I got the open road, and I got my e-brake right here. Okay. I don't. I'm not for this. I'm not. James. Caleb, no, no. Just, this is a bad idea. Just let me do it. No. This don't. <laughs> and it's not. It's not even be bad. What can happen? What's the worst that can happen? I mean, we probably just get nailed by the end of an eighteen wheeler, or dude, they're they're <laughs> way back there. I can barely see them in my rearview mirror. Well, I mean, they'll be way up here whenever you pull the e-brake. Yeah, but. Dude, sick video. We have to try. I don't know, I'm guys. Do uh, I think Caleb has officially lost his mind. Um, I don't know why he wants to freaking pull the e-brake, dude. But um, cruise control at 70 right now. We're going downhill. That's more momentum. I mean, pulling up on a red light. Maybe you could. I'm do doing it, it right now. Ready, ready. Okay. No, no. Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh. We're good, dude. We're good. Oh. It wasn't even bad. Look at that. Caught up to the cars in front of us. Oh, wow. Well, dude, it's, a, it's a Mustang. It's not like we hit crowds or something. It's like we're good drivers, okay? I don't even Jeez. know what to think now. <laughs> dude, my heart is like... Oh my word! I don't even I don't even know, dude. <laughs> Gosh! Woo! That was a rush, dude. Oh wow! Kind of want to do it again, mm. but like um, on a big like one of those you know those really big turns like an off ramp. What, like a a little U? No, like like yeah, one of those off ramps off the highway. Yeah. On the, yeah. And drift? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna just pull it and see what happens. Oh, you just pull it. Okay, that works. On an off ramp, though, so it's it literally will pull you in that direction. Okay. Dude, I drive a Mustang. Okay, I know what I'm talking about. I've seen Tokyo Drift. It's all right, guys. Caleb has seen Tokyo Drift, so we're all good. We are officially uh, put to be drifters. You know, we were born to be drifters. So, we're going to be drifting our way to this American Fitness Expo, and you'll see the rest of the journey. Hopefully, we don't die. Uh, so far, so good. Fingers crossed. Look at that protein over there. All naturally grass-fed. Hey. 
All right, everybody, we've made it to Houston. Uh, we're about to make a pit stop over at Denny's. Get ourselves some nice grub. Dude, yes. And we're gonna go feast, probably, I don't know, maybe get some, something somewhat healthy. Uh, you know, Denny's isn't the healthiest. <laughs> we'll figure uh, it out. You know yeah, saying? you know, we'll get some freaking, probably end up getting some pancakes. <laughs> you know, uh, you gotta keep that diet on point, right? Uh, yeah, you know, it'll be all right. Um, we recover quickly, we're young. Uh, we got that quick metabolism, so you know, everything flows straight to the muscle. Plus, we want a good pump walking around the expo, you know what I mean? Exactly. So, well, you know, we'll get a little bit of sodium in us and get them veins popping. And ooh, they got some Kentucky Fried Chicken over there. <laughs> That'll definitely bring out the sodium right there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah no. So, we just made it to Denny's, we got our food. Got the ultimate omelet, got a fruit bowl, a little bit of carbs in my toast. Excited to eat this. This is a nice cheat meal. Eating it in the morning gives me all day to burn it off and I ain't gotta worry about it. Man, I wonder who lives in that. <laughs> Dang, I know, right in the middle of town. Yeah. You know, I bet they've gotten so many offers I for know. that land. They've probably been offered millions of dollars. Oh yeah. This is where we're gonna be. Looks like we're about to go in the Titanic or something. I, know. I need to figure out where to park. We got these little red vents up there. It looks pretty nice. Just made it. I'm inside the lobby of the convention center. Pretty excited, haven't gone in yet, they're not letting people in, but I'll take you guys through it. Tell them what you're about to do. We're about to do a bunch of curls for fun, because I don't win anything. Hey, but you get a good pump, right? It's all about the pump. Ready, ready, ready? One, two, three, four, five. Fifty more. Fifty. Nice. Hey everybody, here at the expo. Been here for about two hours. Uh, did a couple uh, contests, some uh, pull-up contest, a uh, curl contest. Right now we're taking a break to eat. Got some spinach and chicken. Um, taking some time to eat, and then we're gonna go and we're gonna start uh, visiting the athletes. So we'll take you through it. Hey man, how's it going? What's your name? Hi Caleb. Nice to meet you. All right. So more and everything. Well balance. You guys competitors? Uh, yeah, we actually just recently. Thank you. Yeah. You gotta get that double five. Yeah. 
There you go. Reception. <laughs> All right, everybody. About to go meet Jason Post Stone. We just got to skip the line because we bought some products. It's gonna be pretty nice. We we're waiting for about like 20 minutes. So here we go. We also got to meet Lauren Drain Fit. Uh, she's gonna be me and Caleb's future wife. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I don't think we can share. <laughs> but um, we got to meet Jason Postone. We got to skip the line because we bought a product for $2. So we got some BCAAs. And two bucks, we're waiting in line for about 20 minutes or something like that. We may go get a workout in over at the Alpha Elite are probably some other gym but we're gonna get some good content for y'all so stay tuned all right all right everybody um we're about to go get our workout in over at the alpha elite gym um it's gonna be a good one we're gonna be doing some shoulders biceps and triceps and uh, i believe they let you record in there so we're gonna go ahead and get a little workout in for y'all 
and um, it's gonna be a good one we're gonna get a good pump you know pretty much there's no limitations in this gym everyone has the same mindset you know everyone's trying to get big get swole as you can see we got Caleb eating the greens so you know he's got the right mindset so we did the whole morning at the expo taking a break coming to work out at the Alpha Elite gym here in Houston Texas get a workout in then we're gonna head back to the expo for the rest of the day we started off our arm workout with some cable tower tricep pull downs and form is extremely important when doing these tricep pull downs the main thing is to keep your elbows stationary and what that does is keeps your elbows from swinging up and down and allows you to isolate and concentrate on the tricep motion One of my favorite things that we found out about the Alpha Elite Gym is that it's totally okay to work out without your shirt on and you actually have to sign a waiver saying that you won't have a problem with it and that you can't go to the staff and complain. This is actually the first gym that I've ever been to that completely allowed this. So I wanted to make sure that I was able to get some footage for you guys. This here is actually my favorite tricep workout to do. These are called 21s. So I do my first seven standing straight up, bringing the rope straight down and splitting it at the bottom. And then I lean forward and bring the rope straight down and keeping my hands together towards the bottom. And then the last seven come straight down from the top. What makes this so great is that each motion hits one of the three heads on your tricep. And as you may have noticed during this arm workout, that I do transition after doing four full sets between the bicep and tricep workouts to maximize the full arm pump. The dip machine is great work for your triceps. I do lean slightly forward when I do the dip machine to target the center of my chest as well. I finished off my arms with lightnings because of how they bring your biceps to fatigue. Transitioned from arms to shoulders, and these here are my version of the Arnold Press. I like to go slow and controlled and get a nice full pump. Moved from the Arnold Press, working my front delts into the bent over rear flies isolating my rear delts. I like to transition from hitting my rear delts straight into working my mid delts and I like to do one arm at a time to eliminate swinging and keep the motion slow and controlled. I finalized my workout with some core. Hanging straight forward leg lifts, targeting center core, and then I transition into around the worlds to work in my obliques as well. <laughs> got that stir fry up in here so 
We got that post workout going on right now. So funny story, our video camera actually died right there. So we did end up going back to the expo and I got to meet Cass Martin that you just saw and I got to meet Jay Cutler as well. All right, everybody, that is it for this week's vlog. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more fitness content like it, check out my channel right here. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you all at the next one.